Let's do some more drum eating with Strega. This time, instead of processing break beats, let's use Strega to create some percussion sounds. I know what you're thinking. Why is the zero control up above the Strega? That looks weird. But here's what I'm thinking. We'll use the zero control to sequence a percussion pattern on Strega, and then we'll use the CV generating keyboard, the Arturia key step, to create the notes. First of all, let's listen to Strega's output with no sequencing. The thing to note is that if nothing is in activation, then the time circuits may be silent. Turning time down far enough will bring in some clock noise that creates sort of a sub rhythm. Another thing to note is that this sound will be slightly different from one strega to the next. So if you're patching this up at home and it doesn't sound exactly the same, don't get too upset. So here's a sequence of dynamic envelopes. If we patch this to blend, we can use it to sort of rhythmically bring in this noise from Strega's time circuits. Let's also gate the full range time input. With that pitch CV output. And one of the gate step outputs as well. The sound of these time circuits with nothing in them is going to be a little different from how they'll sound once sound enters their feedback paths. So let's send in some sound. One way is just to turn up activation. Notice that even after we turn it down, we can hear its effect on the time circuits for a little while. Now the simplest way to create notes with the CV keyboard will be to patch its pitch output to volt per octave. And its gate output to activation. This makes very simple notes with very square shapes. If we want to add a little more nuance to the shapes, we can gate the agitation function instead and use that for activation. This lets us sand off those square edges a bit. It also gives us the option of having the filter cutoffs follow the shape of the nose. Let's add a little more nuance by molting that dynamic envelope sequence to the tone control sequencing timbre in the same rhythmic way.
keyboard also has an arpeggiator with a clock input. Let's sync it to the zero control. Clock output. Strega isn't everybody's first go-to for a rhythmic synthesizer, but I've had some fun with it. Do you have any favorite ways to sequence Strega? Let us know in the comments. Thanks for watching, and happy patching.